my school doesn't allow gas unless the first plate is also not allowed or a very a very thick bathroom slippers who is that because why are you smelling in nali like okay you don't know i'm doing video hi guys hi guys nali like hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome and if you are a subscriber welcome back so today we'll be doing the most request requested video which is the precious guide uh short to pack for uni so i have some list here with me so we'll start from the list of what to pack for uni so number one i have buckets bucket is very essential i don't know why some of you come with a whole complex pack and the rest and not bring a bucket especially when you are staying in hostel so it's very important so we have gary I don't know. <laughs> it's very important guys is is a life savior when you are in school fourth we have extension and adapt adapter a lot of people don't have extension in the hostel which causes a lot of fights and all that so Essential is very important, especially when you have like a lot of things. You have a phone, power bank, airport, those things. You need extension for it. The sockets in the room are not much. It's just two for every corner. So you, yeah. Then we have power bank. When, especially when you are coming to Uni Abuja, University of Abuja, it's very, it's very important to have power bank because you need your power bank from twenty thousand mAh above. Just get if I hear the sound of your phone. <laughs> we have an iPad, Android, or laptop. I think we all know this, but yes, if you don't have an iPad or laptop, have another phone. Like if you are using an iPhone, have an Android because you will see shaky. Touch light or lamp. I am guilty of forgetting this because I didn't bring it in my school store. And especially when you go for night classes or you want to even read it at night or go to the toilet you need touch or a, and a lamp and a lamp yeah and septic the towel and the rest you, that's 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 very important you need antiseptic it's a need it's necessity kerosene so if you don't know my school doesn't allow gas unless you're staying in the postgraduate hostel i'll talk about that later so you need stove and kerosene and your kerosene because kerosene here is two thousand per liter i don't know if it's cheaper at your place so it's better you bring it or you just bring a lot like a gallon from your house hot plate is also not allowed hot plate or electric cooker or whatever you call it i'll put it right here it's not allowed then we have mosquito net and repellent like you see oh, from this bunk right here you need there are mosquitoes everywhere in this school it's worse i feel like it's worse so yeah repellent so that repellent is for when you are going for night class yeah night class you need it the rub it around the body and then we have hangers i think everyone knows that then fridge fridge is allowed in this school so you can be your that small half refrigerator you can bring that bedroom slippers and crocs and crocs especially if you are staying in these hostels, old hostel, if it's in Abuja, I mean, you're saying old hostel or new guest hostel or, or that, you need crocs or a very, a very thick bathroom slippers. Um, a mini fan, that mini fan or a portable standing one and sunscreen because the sun is very hot in Abuja. Wawaleda especially. This cancellation stuff, airport, airport, like, like right now, my roommates are making noise. You need. You need things like that. Corporate clothes. Um, you need a cup at least at least two corporate clothes for when you are visiting offices like Senate Building and the rest. You need corporate clothes. Water bottle so that you stay hydrated while you suffer in this school. Very important. That or bottle water. You can bring your pure water or bottle water from home. It might be cheaper at your place sir. Because in this school is I don't know if it's cheaper here. But it's better when you bring it from home. Feminine wash. Feminine wash. Oh, I forgot. Body spray and perfume. I have to talk about this. 
body spray. Please bring your body spray. Please. Because in this school, hmm, the heat and all that, people, I feel like a lot of people don't use body spray and, and roll ons. And, because why are you smelling? Why, why am I going to finish suffering from everything? This one, come and perceive your, your, your odor. It's not nice, guys. So bring your body spray and perfume. Have containers. That's for putting your food, food stuff, your food ingredients, and or need God, especially in this school. You need God. Without God, I don't know how you survive. Need um a touch of craze. This was given to me by my roommates. A touch of craze. If you are not crazy in this school, they will make you crazy. That's just it. Passports. A lot of passports. A lot of passports. Like. Hmm. Passports in this school, they are not cheap. Like, bring a lot of passports. Snap like 30 passports and bring it to this school. They will ask for passports everywhere. Everywhere. Your state of origin. I don't know if other people know this, but I did not know you need a hard copy of your state of origin. So bring that too. Then we have bank. I have a digital bank. One steady bank. And maybe a microfinance i don't really know just have three good banks then tissue yeah then skincare because your skin will suffer very essential essential your shampoos comb, your hair brush your hair whatever bring it um the different types of the different hostel we have in the school in university of abuja we have the old hostel which is this hostel which is it's per room and I don't I, I don't advise anybody to come to this hostel unless that's what you can afford unless that's what you can afford do not come to this hostel eight in a room is not unless you like people you like a lot of people in a room middle hostel which is also the old hostel but just like a mini old hostel I don't know how to say that but it's also eight in the room the space there they don't even have space in their room so I also don't advise that. Then we have the new hostel, which is four, four or two per room. You can get four room. You can get a room with just four people, and you can get you can get a room with just two. So I advise you to go there. It's a bit better. The rooms are better. The environment is better, and uh, but the toilet is still the same. It's still like all wings have particular toilets they use and it's, i don't like it and i don't know. i advise you to go to new hostel too. it's a bit better than this hostel then we have the international hostel the international hostel is three per room and they have a very 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 good toilet inside their room i advise highly advise you to go for international hostel if you can get international hostel, I advise international hostel. That's the one you should go for. You and I think is I think gas is allowed. Gas is allowed in international hostel, ba? Gas is allowed in international hostel, so I advise you to go there too. Then we have the postgraduate hostel. The hostel is actually not just for postgraduates. I think the price is very high. I don't know for you guys how you take it, but the price is very high for an average student. It's very high and still not one person per room, two people per room, but they have the toilets. I think they have their kitchen, gas is allowed, um, electric cookers are allowed. Everything is basically allowed in that hostel. And the hostel is very quiet, very conducive, beautiful. Postgraduate hostel, if you have the money, I advise you to go there too then we have the guide pressures guide for students going to uni especially university of abuja i have done work around in the night nowhere is secure right now not even just in uni abuja everywhere don't walk around in the night avoid men just avoid men that's the second one Third, we have turn on location wherever you're going. Share, share your location to your friends, your roommates, 
your parents before going out don't sag your trouser and uh -huh. this, this is for guys if you come to this school and sag your trouser security will hold you that's the only thing have, have fun as you are reading reading go to some events important events not just partying partying or go to important conferences events network with people that's something i'm trying to do too then we have don't dress inappropriately which i've said before don't dress inappropriately as a girl or as a guy if your hair is too much self they, they can ask you to cut it this school they have a lot of problems no sagging no no um what they call it um crazy yeah crazy trousers cut around it's not allowed in this school just know don't go and bring it to don't go and pack all your clothes to be those type of clothes because you will not be allowed to wear it that's all i have for now thank you so much for listening please like and subscribe and follow me on my other socials at halal jan content creator and you can recommend more videos and the postal tour will be coming soon i'm currently writing my exams second semester exams so i'm i'm busy right now that's why that's why the video hasn't been done but very soon the video will be done with the hostel tour so stay tuned subscribe to the channel bye